Open User Management from the Website tab in Complio Console. This tab is only available to the users that have been given administrative rights. From here, you can assign console users access to the Website tab. Only the users that have been added to the Website User Management tab will be given access to Website for all approval and signing activities. Click on New to add users. A window displaying a list of console users appears on the screen. You can select one or multiple users at once. For making multiple selections, drag the cursor across the name of users you wish to add, or while pressing down on the control key, left click on the usernames to select the desired users. Click on Apply to add the users. You can choose to give the users administrative rights by selecting the checkbox under the administrator column in the interface. The member of column displays the name of groups which the respective user is a member of. You can delete user to remove their access to the website tab. Select the checkbox and click the delete button to remove that user from the website users list. You can also remove multiple users at once by making multiple selections. The Edit button allows you to add a user to the defined groups. Groups can be created under the User Group Management tab. More details have been provided further in this video. Click on the Refresh button to update the contents or changes in contents in the interface. Next, we have the User Group Management tab. This tab also is only available to the users who have been given administrative rights. Using this tab, you can define user groups and assign members to those groups as per requirement. This is helpful when it comes to segregating users as per departments or as per process, depending on your business needs. Let's define a few groups and assign members to them. Click on New to define a new group. Enter the name of the group and click on Apply. In order to add members to the group, click on Add, which opens the list of users that have been given website rights under the User Management tab as shown earlier. Select the users that you want to add to the group and click on Add. The newly created group is displayed on the interface. Let's define another group by using the same process. You can also choose to delete these groups using the Delete button. And you can also remove or add more users to the group by selecting the Edit option. From the Group window, you can select a user or select multiple users in order to delete the users, or click Add to include more members to the selected group. Click on Refresh to update the contents or changes in contents in the interface. You can also assign users to groups from the User Management tab. Select a user and click on the Edit button. Click on Add and select the desired group from the displayed list of groups. This is how you can assign a user to a group from either the User Management tab or the User Group Management tab. Thank you for watching this video.